Submissions 101, I'm going to talk about the Anaconda Body Lock and some of the particulars escapes uh, from it. It's a really uh, strong position when you have your partner's back. It can also be done from the guard. Now the Anaconda Body Lock, I'm in, I'm going for a choke. And say we fall to the side, I hook it in like so. Now you notice, anytime I have the anaconda body lock, I have my toes up, like so. This is where I want to have it as I'm attacking. I don't like leaving this leg hanging down because I don't want him to catch it at all. So when I go for the lock, I usually peer and I place it so I feel his leg and I'm squeezing in. Now what Tristan would probably do is try to turn. That's when I switch and just do a con to switch here. He might do it again here. Now the reason I'm doing that is because I don't want to be caught him falling with my toes down like that. I don't want that because of the lock that can occur. So I'm going to show you one of the reasons that you want to do the con to switch. Okay. So what we'll do is actually turn. So he's got the body lock in. I'm defending. If I ever feel this, I will purposely try to drive to the side which he has the lock and pin it to the mat. When he pins it to, when I pin it to the mat here, I'm holding tight, defending my neck, shrugging my shoulders, I'm taking the leg which is closest to the ground, and I'm peeling this back. Now when I do that, I might not be able to get the tap, so what I'm trying to do is peel this back and pushing my hips forward, so I can attack the uh, actual ankle. So sometimes over here, he's flexible, I might need to push that out, take the other leg and hook. So you'll see that I'm hooking the ankle and I'm pulling that back towards my butt and then I'm extending, pushing out to get the ankle lock. So Tristan has that in. I shrug. I fall. I'm trying to peel this here and pushing my hips up. If I can't get it and I'm trying to be super flexible, I will pin it, I'm leaning on it hard, put that out, and I'll scoop the other heel down, grabbing at the ankle, peel back towards my butt, and then I'll go for it by extending up. So the Anaconda Body Lock is a really good way to shear in and uh, just keep your opponent uh, nice and uh, uh, tight and being able to control them. But like I said, if you fall, make sure that that ankle lock is not there to do the condo switch.